Almost a year to the date of the 2020 election, many citizens showed up the Crow Wing County Board meeting requesting a forensic audit of the county's election results. Crow Wing County reported a record turnout during last year's election with nearly 79% of the county casting votes. Those who attended the meeting say they would not only like a full audit of the election, but also a request to for, for scenically examine the voting machines. My heart is telling me that there is something drastically wrong with this election. And I urge all of you to follow your heart. And I'm praying for God to touch your heart to say that we need have an obligation to our grandkids to say that if we did not do anything and we find out later that there was massive fraud, our kids are going to say, Grandpa, why didn't you do something when you had the chance? Are you confident that every ballot that was cast was counted in a fair and transparent manner? I'm sorry to tell you. But this old soldier is not confident. As is typical during open forum, commissioners did not respond to what the citizens said. However, during the October 19th Committee of the Whole meeting, Commissioners Paul Coring and Steve Barrows both voiced their support of county election staff. I will say publicly that I trust that everything in Crow Wing County is being done the proper way and there is no... Um, fraudulent activity happening here at all. I want to thank all of our election judges in Crow Wing County, our staff, and anyone else that works on the election process. In Crow Wing County, this board supports exactly what has taken place. We follow the statutes. We do exactly what we're supposed to do, and we find nothing nefarious about the activities that take place in the election process in Crow Wing County. The county board says they do not have the legal authority to request a recount of votes. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.